everyone welcome back to the channel happy vlogmas today is gonna be another vlog for you guys i hadn't been filming for a while today is wednesday i didn't film on monday or tuesday i took the two days off just because i've been having a lot of back pain like i said on my previous video it's been horrible today is feeling a little bit better i'm not feeling that bad i do um want to go into the chiropractor so i can get it checked and then i'm also going to book an appointment to get a massage because i really do think it's a lot of like just tension because it starts from my neck all the way down to my the lower body um so yeah that's what i've been dealing with i'm actually going to go to the gym today um i haven't been going to the gym but i am going to go today i've been i shouldn't say i haven't been going to the gym because i have been going to the gym but i've been doing cardio so that's what I'm going to do today. I'm just going to go on the elliptical and just walk. Um, I'm not doing anything too crazy. If I do a little bit of legs, they're going to be weightless. Um, but yeah, that's what I've been trying to do is just keep it easy at the gym. Not trying to do too much if I do go. Um, also, Anthony might get off of work early today. But I have to run and get some last minute stuff done. Because my brother, I don't know if I mentioned, my brother... Um, recently got married and my older brother recently got married and they're having their, um, ceremony. They're just like, I guess their party on Sunday of this week. And I have not got an outfit at all for the wedding. Um, I might just wear the same black one that I wore for the other one, but it's going to be really cold. So I'm thinking about maybe purchasing a pantsuit or like a longer skirt or something like that because it's going to be cold or like something that I can wear with nylons black nylons because it's going to be freezing it's going to be in the bay area and it's a lot colder than the last wedding we went to now so um i'm probably gonna go do some cardio get that out of the way and then go see if i can find something at tj maxx marshall's or like kohl's to wear for this weekend i also have to call around and make sure that i have all the pastries done because i'm bringing the pastries to the wedding so uh, i need to make sure that that's done and settled but how are you guys feeling? Did you guys enjoy my little shorts of the stocking stuffer ideas? If you guys did, let me know because I have other ideas as well. And I can make separate short videos of that or just a specific video on it. Um, by the way, I got this thing for Emma last year. It's a um, Melissa Doug. I, Doug Melissa or Melissa Doug, whatever. I got this last year and it's super cute. She's been playing with it this year. I took it out of the garage. We cleaned out our garage, by the way. Didn't film it. But we cleaned out our garage so we can put all our of our gym equipment in there. So that's what we've been doing with Anthony as well is just uh, making our garage into a gym. Just in case for the days that we're not able to go work out at the gym, we have our garage to do so. But that's what we've been doing this past couple of days. Cut the numbers. 20. 20. What numbers? Count the numbers. Two. Two. What's the numbers? Look who's back from school playing with her little, her little Christmas tree. Um, oh, Christmas tree. Oh, oh, Christmas tree. Oh, no. Oh, no. Let's see. Oh, see. Little Miss Emster did not have a good day in school today. Don't mind my big old sit, guys. I still have it. It's right here. It's popping out for you guys. It's like, what's up? It's like saying, hello, hello, what's up? So, yeah, I guess Emma did not have a good day of school today. We picked her up, and she was um, verbally stimming a lot today in class and crying while she was singing her ABCs and all that. But I don't know what was wrong with her because... As soon as she got home, she was fine. So I don't know if it, she, she just wanted to be with us. And also there was uh, other little kids that were pretty like much crying a lot when they were getting dropped off today. So I don't know if maybe that threw her off or since other kids were not having it, then she was kind of like doing that because of that. I don't know. But um, yeah, we just got home from picking her up. Actually, not just. She just took a nap and got up right now and we're waiting for the ABA therapist Today is the first at-home session in like two weeks, so I'm excited about that. And me and Anthony are probably going to do a little workout here. Um, I didn't get a chance to go to the gym, so we're probably going to do a little workout here where the, while the therapist and the supervisor are here today. 
and I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about the broccoli sprouts. Okay, so you guys know that Emma has been having a cough for since August. We kind of calculated the time of the cough and we're, we're thinking it was the broccoli sprouts. So we stopped giving it to her for how long, babe? For like a week now? How long have we stopped the broccoli sprout for like a week? Two weeks. I don't think it's been more than two weeks. Well, we stopped it for like let's say two weeks, um, and she finally stopped coughing, like what, three, four days ago? Yeah. Her cough stopped, so she's not coughing during the day anymore. Um, she's not coughing at all at night or anything, so we were thinking maybe it might have been the broccoli sprout, but the only way to find out is to give her the broccoli sprout again. Now, um, we were giving her that thorn one, so instead of giving her the thorn one, we're starting to give her the other brand, the one, the chewable one. Let me show you guys. So instead of giving her the thorn one, because maybe she's allergic to something that's in there, we started giving her this one and we've just been crushing it and putting it in her drink. We started today. So we're gonna see if she gets the cough again. It could also be the brand, maybe the brand, or maybe it's just something off, you know, and we stopped it and something happened that it, you know, she stopped coughing, but we're gonna keep you guys informed in like the next two or three days, maybe four days, see if her cough starts again. But so far, no cough, and we're starting her back on the, the other one, but the different brand to see what happens and to see if maybe that was it. So that's what's been going on here. All right, guys, it is the next day. We are actually shopping. We're on the line for Chick-fil-A. We went to go buy Adrian some pants and a shirt for Saturday for the wedding. So we were doing that. It's kind of sunny today, so I have to put on my glasses. And we're going to go to Chick-fil-A. I'm going to buy Adrian some food, Emma some fries, and myself a coffee so we can head home. My mom is watching Emma for us right now and um, she has ABA therapy, which by the way, yesterday's ABA therapy went so, so good. She was so happy to see the therapist and the supervisor. She had not seen them in, in a very long time, so she was super excited and um, she had a really good session. Did you wanna say anything about your academy um, thing this weekend that you volunteered? It's confidential. Oh yeah. Adrian's in the, what academy is it called? I know it's an academy, but I don't know what it's called. Cop Academy? Cop Academy. <laughs> Criminal and Justice. Criminal Justice. Cop Academy. <laughs> and he had to go help out this weekend, so he did all of that. But, yeah. We're going to just wait on this long Chick-fil-A line so we can get our, our chicken. Oh. Our chicken. What are you doing? <laughs> he hates when I vlog. <laughs> All right, guys, there she is again playing with her little Melissa and Doug Christmas tree. She is just snacking and having some goldfishes. We're obviously back, and Emma loves lining up her little things. I was just going to show you guys that we moved her little um, house over here just for now so she can play with the ABA therapist. They've been playing with it and doing all the good stuff, but we are back. A therapy is done. Emma is about to get ready to take a bath. I kind of just wanted to show you guys a couple of things that I got her from Old Navy that I thought were super cute. Um, I got her a little jacket because she doesn't have, besides the plaided jacket that my mom got her, she doesn't have a, a big thick jacket with a hood. So I ended up picking up this cute little jacket in the color gray. It has like little bunny ears. It is a size 3T because she just doesn't fit in 4T yet. And I feel like the, the arms are way too long for her whenever I get her a 4T. But I thought it was really, really cute. It's super warm from the inside. And it has the little brown buttons and little pockets on the side as well. 
Now, this is the dress that I'm thinking about putting her in. She got this for Christmas last year, but it fits her now. So for the wedding, we might put her in this little outfit with that little jacket, yeah. leggings, and some boots or dress shoes. I'm not sure. But I also ended up picking up a little... What? What's going on? Hey, talking to your friends. I'm telling them about your clothes that I got you. Yeah. yeah. I also ended up getting her this little dress from Old Navy that I might put her on for the wedding instead, or put on her, put this on for, I can't talk, hold on, please hold. So it's kind of like a Christmas, Christmassy material. I don't know how to say this, but yeah. So it's cute, loose dress. So I was thinking about putting maybe this one on with some black leggings and her boots and just like the little jacket on top. I don't know. So I am debating from this one or this one. Anthony doesn't like this one at all. He just doesn't like this material. He thinks it's ugly. I think it's cute, but he doesn't like it. So I might just put her in this. So it might be one of these two. And then I got my dress for $16. Make you hella at Ross. Please hold. All right, so it's like a turtleneck, long sleeve, but the sleeves are kind of see-through. I don't know if you can see, they're just see-through and it has like polka dots. It has like a little turtleneck on it and then it has like this little waist line to it, like stretchy waist and this. So that's how it looks. I think I'm gonna wear this with either leggings and some boots or just some boots or close close toe shoes. But I thought it was cute. It looks better on, honestly, than how it looks, how I'm showing you right now, but it's really cute. And it, it was only $16, so I was super proud of myself on not overly spending. Hey you, are you ready to take a bath? What was that noise? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and get this little girl's bath ready and get her in the bath. Hey guys, I'm over here making some ground turkey tacos. It's not even Taco Tuesday, guys. I'm honestly getting so sick of making the exact same food week by week. We have soup, we have tacos, we have spaghetti, we have <sighs> chicken flautas. It's just like, ugh. I don't know. Do you guys feel that way? Do you guys feel like you guys are repetitive on your meals over and over and over again? I do. I feel like I'm getting tired of it. I'm going to start Pinteresting some stuff because I need to switch it up. Let me know if you guys are getting tired of your meals. And if I start Pinteresting some meals ideas, I might share them here with you guys because I am getting so sick so sick of the same food over and over and i definitely need to switch it up even on my healthy meals because obviously anthony's gonna have the tacos and i'm gonna have the bowl um but even on that i'm just like ugh. i'm getting bored i'm getting bored of all of this sorry guys my phone turns on the flashlight in english Hey babe, do you want to tell the the peeps here what happened with Emma's mattress when we put it on the floor and we we put her to sleep there for like the first thirty minutes? Uh, we would, I felt bad when I came to bed and I told you to grab her. Yeah, we suck. It wasn't even Emma waking up or anything. We just <laughs> put her to sleep in her bed and then we got her after 30 minutes just because the bed felt so toot, big. Toot. Hello. Who Hola. will ride on my bus today? Hola. Hola, Benji y Lily. Les gustara dar un paseo en bus. <laughs> Let's go, vamonos. <laughs> White boy trying to be spent. Hop on, Ricky, Kiki, and Nikki. Suban.
Ricky, Kiki, and Nikki. We are going for a bus ride. Vámonos a dar un pasillo en bus. Let's go. Vámonos. Look at Emma. She looks like she's about to knock out. The wheels on the bus go round and round. Oh, what's she got? Round and round, 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 round and round